welcome. I'm pleased to be here at Cybos 2025 in Frankfurt, Germany, one of the financial capitals of Europe and the world. And Cybos is the SWIFT event that every year is in a different part of the world. It's one of the key events for everyone in the year. And we'll probably have something in the neighborhood of 13,000 bankers and fintech companies here in Frankfurt, Germany. Now, what's special about today is I have a great guest with me today, and I'd like to introduce Tyler. Tyler, how are you? Great. Great. Tyler, please tell us a little bit about yourself, the company, the product line, wherever you want to go. I'm Tyler Durer. I'm the Chief Technology Officer here at Broadridge. I've been with the company a little over a decade. And in our journey as an organization, it's really our evolution to become a platform company, really helping clients co-develop with us to take on the new challenges that are in the industry, really value props around AI, around how they can leverage API integration so that they can build capabilities that allow them to innovate in cases where they want to have the user experience. They've got vended solutions that they need to operate with that really need to talk to our platform. And allowing clients to really build a long-term relationship with us that's a foundation for a platform that they're able to innovate, they're able to grow, and they're able to solve real business problems. You know, Tyler, very interesting, uh, the, the platform approach, because there's so many different applications, products, needs out there, and how do you kind of bring them all together? But I think when a lot of people hear that, they think more about a, a captive customer rather than being very complimentary to the customer. And to talk through that, uh, it's really through a, a common data ontology. Standardizing data is important for several elements. AI needs it. You need to have hygienic and cleansed data in order to have AI operate effectively, lower the risk. It's also about having well-defined APIs, and those APIs being something your clients can co-innovate on. They're able to build applications with. And that's really opening up the value prop is I think about a CTO of our own organization, it's really trying to build that same type of capability so that CTOs of my clients are able to do the kind of valued work that they need to do as a part of the Broadridge platform. And so that's really the API framework, the common data ontology, and then also a workstation framework that allows you to really bring the UX and the UI together on the front end so that systems really look like a cohesive, uh, a cohesive platform from Broadridge. You know, Tyler, one thing that I'm, I'm hearing from you is, yes, AI is important. We know it's a big buzzword. It is today in Cybos itself. But yeah. what I don't hear a lot about is the API side of it. So you have AI, but how do you make it work with everything? And, and how do you connect all these things so you can get value out of it? Well, as, a, as an organization over the time that I've been with the firm, we've grown through acquisition. And so bringing in new companies that solve real challenges for our clients in the industry, having a common data ontology really allows us to bring those acquisitions in and new products that we develop and quickly assemble them into the platform. The API approach is really taking that common data ontology, then exposing that data via APIs and allowing a developer at one of our client sites to really use well-defined and well-documented APIs to help them build out their capabilities. But API integration and the use of capabilities around that is really opening our platform. And that's really opening a platform so that clients really view us as a long-term partner that they can co-innovate with. So I really like the way you speak about this opening of the platform. So in effect, you're giving the, the client the ability on your platform to do what they need and what they want. That's right. That's right. And it's really around thinking less about buying top to bottom solutions from Broadridge. We will always do that in market. But we're, we have places where clients really want to build and buy capabilities from us via APIs, they have the ability to do it. It's allowing them to solve real discrete problems when they need to, but build over the long term so that the investments that they make, they can capitalize over future years with Broadridge on the platform. Well, it, and I like just now the future years because right now I want to ask, what is the future, both of the industry as well as, as, as broad, Broadridge's product? You know, the, Hot topic here has really been a lot about tokenization. And the thing that I would say is, when you think about all of the offerings in market, we already transact on a tokenized type platform. And it was something we organically built here at Broadridge. And the thing that I would say that I'm very proud of is I hear a lot of firms talking about where they're wanting to go 
at this conference. And it's exciting to hear that because it's an interesting topic, but we're doing it right now. And so I feel like we have a very leading position in helping clients solve the challenges that they're talking about today that they want to solve into the future. Well, you know, it's quite interesting because, yeah, I, I hear also a lot on tokenization, but it's more about what we hope for, what we want to do, what we will do. It's not we are doing. Right. So you kind of a unique position in being able to, to say today in the market that we are doing. And, and that's, uh, once again, as a organization that grew up with a founder that was really a startup mentality, we've continued to try to keep that heritage and have really accelerated it over the last three to four years. It's getting back to our roots, thinking like a startup, thinking like a founder, and continuing to innovate products so that we can ensure that we're competitive for our clients for the industry, and that we're able to deliver solutions that add real value. Well, Tyler, I really appreciate you spending some time with us at Financial IT. Quite interesting, and wish you the best of success at Broadridge, and thank you for joining us at Cybos. Yeah, great, thank you very much.